in a crisis, we can come together as a community to help these fire victims. In Hamul, community members are banding together to help a family-owned farm decimated by the Valley Fire. As our ABC Tenders reporter Michael Chen discovered, the owners say the help will mean the difference between survival and folding up. At Hidden Haven Farms in Hamul, a harvest of goodwill. A lot of outreach, a lot of volunteers. Two weeks after the Valley Fire ravaged the 16-year-old farm known for sustainable farming. A lot of love, a lot of help. Before the help, there was the fire. Farm owner Cheryl Skidmore was on the phone with workers on site. It was very, very smoky and the fire hit the ridge and then just came down. It was very fast. Some animals were evacuated, but the damage was heavy. All 125 chickens were killed. Most of the crops were destroyed. Half the orchards from apples to apricots and all of the industrial hemp fields, along with much of the farm equipment. Now everything's just devastated, so we I mean, we have to start over. Skidmore says she tried to get wildfire insurance, but was denied partly because she's in a fire prone area. The total loss about $250,000. Shutting down the farm became very possible. It's overwhelming. The word overwhelming could also be used to describe the outpouring of support. The farm asked for help and the community responded. Dozens of volunteers at three cleanup efforts, including one on this day. Volunteers raking ash, trimming trees, moving dirt. Jordan Brewer is is one of those volunteers. When I saw the pictures and devastation, it made me upset. And if I was in that situation, I'd want people to come and help me. Skidmore says that help will mean the difference between shutting down and keeping the farm going. People still want to help other people. It just made me feel so good because there's just no way that I, I could have done this. Michael Chen, ABC 10 News.